This Liberty Sports Update is brought to you by Beacon Credit Union. Lady Flames taking on the Lipscomb Bisons in A-Sun Hoops Tuesday night. Liberty looking to stop a two-game skid. Lipscomb just 1-9 in the conference. Basketball is a team game, but Emily Lytle was a one-woman assault team in this one. Out of the gate, Lytle scored the first 13 points in the game. Not for a team, first 13 points in the game. A little more than four minutes in, Bridget Redstad scores off a Lipscomb turnover. The first points from a flame not named Lytle. Liberty up 15-3, and Lytle in the corner again. Are you kidding me? She's heating up. 18-3, Liberty. Lytle at 16 in the first quarter. Flames led it 20-6 after one. Second quarter, Ashton Baker, second game back from the injury. Here's her first point since coming back. Jumper makes it 32-16, Liberty. Flames led this one 35-21 at the half. Third quarter, Flames needed someone besides Lytle. It's Rhea Gully's birthday. Why not her? Dully scores off the Lipscomb turnover, puts Liberty up 39 to 21. Liberty with 34 points off 22 Lipscomb turnovers in this one. Fourth quarter, Lipscomb trying to get back in it though. The Bisons went on a 9-0 run. Keely Morrow drains a three here to cut it to 15, 60 to 45. Morrow led Lipscomb with 22 on the night. Kaylee Rosenbaum, count it and one. All of a sudden, it's a nine point game, y'all. Liberty with a scoring drought of almost five minutes. Bridget Redstad says that's enough of that. 62 to 51, Liberty leads by 11 with less than four minutes to go. Less than three minutes now, more gully. Three ball, dagger. Puts Liberty up 13. The birthday girl scored all 17 of her points in the second half. The Lady Flames go on to win this one by 14, 74 to 60. Emily Lytle, after the hot start, finished with a game high 24 points, two off her career high. Flames improved to 6-5 and five in the A-Sun and a milestone for head coach Kerry Green, career win number 450, 16th active winningest coach in Division I women's basketball, a special night for Coach Green and a big win for the Flames. I am certainly blessed and uh, I had no, I wasn't unaware of it till like yesterday. And uh, it's not something that we're looking for. Uh, we feel like our ministry is to uh, help young people, these young ladies to develop, uh, is to be Christian champions and that's in every area and uh, we, we have fun doing it with, with a game of basketball. I've certainly been blessed and any milestone is usually a combination of um, several people investing and certainly my family, my wife and some great assistants and obviously some great ball players. Emily um, is obviously a, a great shooter if, if she can use her screens and move really quick and get her feet set, she doesn't have to put it on the floor. And uh, those are just areas where she continues to work on and develop. I mean, it feels good. Anytime you hit a shot, it feels really good. And, you know, I had one teammate out, and then my teammates were doing a great job finding me. So I love the three. I try to be like Clay Thompson. <laughs> She played incredible tonight. She did so well. And um, I think at one point she was the only person who had scored on our team. We celebrate her successes. So just as much as she's enjoying scoring, we're enjoying watching her score. Like, her joy is our joy.